Hey guys, it's Milana here. Welcome to my channel. This is a little bit of a different video. It's a bit more intimate because I'm in my pajamas. It's 9.56 p.m. on Sunday night and I have been working away on my poetry book. I'm super excited about it. I'm trying to get it out as soon as possible. I'd love to have it done before I go on my trip to Kauai next week. Um, so that would just be amazing because I'd love to record content, reading my poems straight out of my book for you guys in Kauai. That just sounds so magical and so pure. So I've just been working like crazy to get this done. Um, one thing that's cool, I will say, like whatever you're working on in your life and whatever you're creating, the divine and the universe will always recognize your efforts and match your efforts. A cool synchronicity that happened to me today is I've been needing to edit my poetry book for weeks. And I am very much like, I love the big dreams. I love the creativity parts of creating and making things happen. I don't love like getting into the details and the nitty gritty. And I don't care about grammar and editing and stuff like that. So I was kind of avoiding the editing, honestly. But today I finally sat down and started editing my book. And then I noticed that one of my friends, he's also a poet who has an amazing book. Um, he told me he would edit my book and I sent it to him a few weeks ago. And I wasn't really expecting him to like edit it or, or give me any feedback because he's super busy. Um, but I noticed that he had actually texted me. Cole is growling at me right now. Cole, I'll take you out a minute, okay? He had actually texted me like right around the time that I sat down to like work on editing my book. And he was like, hey, I just wanted to let you know, I just finished reading through your book. It's amazing. The world is so lucky to have this gift. And like, I'm so excited for everyone to read your book. Um, he just had this amazing feedback. And I was like, wow. The universe is matching my efforts like when I sat down to like do this part of the process I didn't really want to do the universe gave me this gift of someone else contributing to my creation by like him reviewing it and giving me feedback so that was just a really cool synchronicity oh my gosh Koa stop come here ah Ugh, Koa starts to get a little feisty when he wants something. Basically when he wants attention or food or to go to the bathroom and go outside. So it's always one of three things. Anyways, I forget what I was even saying. What was I saying, Koa? You threw me off. You threw off my, my flow. I can't remember what I was saying. You can sit on the chair next to me. Um, what was I going to say? So yeah, anyways. The universe is always noticing your efforts and the universe loves to see you investing in yourself and you taking action towards your dreams and towards what you're working on and it will invest in you back and it gives you even more of the investment than you put in, if that makes sense. So super numerical and mathematical, here we are. It is late and I am sounding a bit incoherent, so I'm gonna wrap this up, but I wanna share a poem with you guys since I'm working so feverishly. What kind of words am I even using? See, I usually go to bed at like nine o'clock and it's now 10 o'clock and I've been working, so that kind of makes my brain a little frazzled. But I just wanted to show you guys some behind the scenes of what goes, what's going into my life right now and what I'm working on and what I'm so passionate about. And it's this book and I'm super excited to share it with you. I'm gonna read you a poem that's in my book right now. And it's, I really love it and I think you'll love it too. No wonder I love the ocean and the stars and flowers and strangers. I am part of them and I created them because separation is an illusion. I am one with everything and everyone. And when I love something, 
that appears to be outside of me. It's really just a part of me that I have not yet seen. I wrote this because I had this realization a while ago. I was like, hmm, I think that when we love something, it's because maybe because we created it, you know, we're all we're all part of God, we're all part of the universe, we are all really one, and separation is such an illusion. Um, yeah, we're all just, we're all one. We're one cohesive, coherent unit. And in the physical matter to matter, like when you're plugged into the dimensions of your body with your senses, it appears that we're separate, but really when you take away the physical matter, and you go back to the spiritual realm and the fifth dimension, we're all just connected into this one spiritual energy. So anyways, that's a poem from my book. Uh, stay tuned. If you're not already subscribed to my channel, please make sure you're subscribed. Go ahead and thumbs up this video. Comment below what your thoughts are on um, investing in your future and investing in your dreams, showing up and doing the work and any cool synchronicities or things that have happened for you guys as you are working towards your dreams and creating creating your dream life and bringing those things into your reality. Or let me know what you thought about my poem. What do you think about it? Can you relate? Did it make you think about things differently? Did it make you feel a certain type of way? Whatever it is you have to say, I want to hear it. So leave a comment below and let's connect. Um, yeah, I hope to see you guys soon at the next video.